Hello, everyone. My name is Hyung Hong from ASIS Motion Development Team. I'd like to discuss with you an overview of vehicle dynamics modeling. This does not cover the entire modeling process, but covered an important part of vehicle dynamics analysis with an emphasis on vehicle data. A big chunk of engineers' effort is to collect the good vehicle data to put together a model. A good data set give good result. More training programs will be prepared soon to run vehicle dynamic analysis and how to apply analysis result to product development. A vehicle dynamics model has many components and subsystems. Subsystems and full vehicle models are built to answer questions for design decisions. Does a vehicle design satisfy vehicle performance requirements for vehicle handling, ride, durability, NVH, and so on? Vehicle dynamics engineers should have a good understanding about vehicle underbody and suspension system, including wheels and tires. They should also understand vehicle systems not directly related to vehicle dynamics performances. Deliverables from vehicle dynamic analysis are displacement, velocity, acceleration, force, and moments from vehicle system. A full vehicle model is an assembly of several vehicle subsystems. The number of passengers, cargo, trim height of the vehicle should be comprehended properly. The list of vehicle subsystems has front and rear suspensions, powertrain, vehicle body, steering, driveline, tire and wheels, and brake. The list can grow to have more subsystems such as ballast and trailers. We will go review details of those subsystems soon. Subsystems have many components of rigid bodies, joints, bushings, jumps and rebound bumpers, springs, dampers, or shocks, flex bodies and gears. More control subsystems are being incorporated into vehicle dynamics models. They are steering control, chassis control, brake control, and engine drive unit controls. As vehicles get electrified, more control systems are incorporated. ADAS, active safety, autonomous driving are a few of them. Vehicle Dynamics model can also simulate special customer use cases, jacking and vehicle shipping. Simulation can give an idea how much jack stroke and force are required to replace a flat tire. Shipping simulations guide a tie-down design not to fail during shipping. Towing and ditch recovery need a thorough design for its function.